So I have a question for you because we were just we were talking about the OHL. There's one that I know uh, some of the guys on the hockey fight boards we were talking about it uh, today. They want to know about the Jake Gilmore fights in the O. Oh, yeah, Jake, Jake Gilmore. It's rest a in peace. yeah, very sad story, but he it was a very tough fighter. Oh my God! You guys went head to head twice, I yeah. believe. Tell tell us about those fights, yeah, man. Well, Jake was one of the heavies, um, and so the first year was I don't think he was there my first year, but my second year when you're already the guy. Yeah. And then he comes in and he's the good guy. Too. He's with Belleville Bulls yeah, and you're with Windsor. Covered, so we're like yeah. we barely play each other, but that's the the Noof was out. Remember the Noof? It's called the no. Noof. It was an uh, an internet site okay. that had all the fights on it. It was hockey fights. Yeah. Pre hockey fights. Okay. And it's like fuck, you're reluctant to go on there because all the other fans hate you and they're beaking you. And it's the first time you ever see anybody really chirp you. Because you're on the fucking internet for the first time. Yeah, yeah. So it's a build up between us, and we fucking and I was I, I look back at that fight. I'm so sloppy, like you know, you just learn so much from from you know fighting yeah. the goddamn time. And we went and I hit him hard, man. You were I hitting fucking hit him from, hard from back, and he was throwing shorter jackhammers, like, and you were we throwing both fall, get back up, blah, yeah. Blah, blah, blah. That, that we both started the game. We both went buckets off. Like it was let's wicked. Fucking the, the put on spin the fucking, I'm spinning that motherfucker. Let's go. And I can take my shit off in the fucking uh, the uh, penalty box too because the fans <laughs> won. And that's what you just did. And you feed off it. And yeah. we kicked the fuck out of each other twice. And it was cool, man. Like, but that kind of fucked me up a little bit. I'm not gonna lie to you. Yeah. Lou Lamarillo had to call me after I got drafted, and he said, "Stop acting like." the fucking OHL fight champion and start playing hockey too. Yeah, yeah. And I'm like, okay, I will. And then I got traded to Guelph. We won a championship and all that stuff. Mm-hmm. But I was just putting on a goddamn show, dude. Oh, like, it was great. Too much. <laughs> I know. I, it, it was, was like, great. I needed to worry about the game a little more. Ah, Instead of going and hitting guys and all of a sudden just buckets off, spinning it like fucking doing I, it. I'm you telling know? you right now, if Cam had 50% less idiot in him, he probably would have scored 15 goals in the league. A year. He was that. Like he's that fast. He crushes guys. He's got good hands. Like when well, now he doesn't have to worry about fighting when he's out skating with us. Like he's a good hockey player. But when he was out on the ice, he couldn't take. He couldn't help. He couldn't get the idiot out of him. And if he would, if he would have had less, if he would have had fifty percent left, idiot, he would have been. He would have been a hell of a third liner. Blame my fucking parents.